Alright, welcome guys to my very first YouTube video. Um, as you guys saw the thumbnail, yes. So I graduated from Georgia Tech with a bachelor's in mechanical engineering. Now, I didn't leave or stop pursuing my career because I was bad at engineering. I was actually that kid in the back of the class just looking out the window and thinking, hmm, how do I make money? It is not to say that you can't make money as a mechanical engineer, of course you can. With a span of like one to five years in the career, you can potentially make 120 to like $150,000 a year. And that's pretty good, you're pretty well set. If you follow the route of actually creating a company, doing a startup, creating a company, yeah, the possibilities are endless. You can make seven, eight, even potentially nine figures, and that's really good. You know, it's very respectable. As a real estate agent, however, it's a little bit more attainable. It's easier. Um, it's a little bit more secure than doing a startup as an engineer. So then I started researching ways to make money. And my initial idea was actually to get into the stock market. I started researching, I actually took a course, learned how to day trade, and every morning I would get up 9 a.m., grind it out, then I started realizing that over time it was gonna take a little bit too long. So then I was like, okay, my mom's a, a real estate agent, she made decent money, so I was like, okay, I'll get my real estate license, sell some houses, make some decent money, but use those funds to invest into my stock career. But I started doing some more digging and realized that 90% of millionaires come from real estate because it's so broad. You have so many different opportunities. You have residential, you have commercial. You can flip houses, you can construct new houses, sell them. It's just so many different opportunities to create wealth off real estate. And I see that now. So instead of getting to the stock market and making that my official career, I decided to get into real estate and make that my official career. And so then I started researching, how do I become the best real estate agent? Got across a mentor, he started mentoring me, and then I joined EXP Realty. Within EXP Realty, I got another mentor. Now, I live in Georgia, but I have specialized myself as a real estate agent in Miami, Florida. I get a lot of questions, it's like, why would you do that? What makes you think that anybody's gonna choose you over somebody that lives in Miami? And that's a valid point, you know, I understand that. But even though I don't live in Miami, I have still researched and researched I went through. I've gone through articles, blogs, statistics of every single aspect of Miami, from travel times to transportation, to the lifestyle, the atmosphere, all sorts of things. Now, why would I choose to do real estate in Miami rather than Georgia if I live in Georgia, right? Well, as for me, I believe in that idea of creating your own lifestyle. If I was to follow mechanical engineering, I would get my degree, work a nine to five, right? I don't want that type of lifestyle. I kind of want to create my own, more so like an entrepreneur type of lifestyle where I choose how to run my business. I choose uh, what to do from hour to hour, from day to day, right? And so that's why I chose real estate. I can travel to Florida, I get to dress up, and I get to, to, to tour all those multi-million dollar condos in Sunny Isle Beach in Miami, and I get to put that all on YouTube, put that on social media, uh, Instagram, TikTok, so that all the audience that it's interested gets to see all of that. It is amazing. I get to do what I love. I have work as my vacation every single day it's just basically vacation because I fall in love with what I do and I enjoy what I do. As for my future videos, I'll be going over property tours, community tours in Miami and Sunny Isle Beach. I'll also be going over market research, market reports of 2023, comparing them to 2024, what you can expect from 2024, whether the prices are gonna go up, interest are gonna go down. If you're somebody that's looking to relocate to Miami, whether you're coming from New York or you're coming from California or any other state, and you wanna live somewhere in Miami or Sunny Isle Beach, don't hesitate to reach out. If you're an investor that's curious about how the market is in Miami, whether you wanna purchase a condo residence, put it out to rent, or list it on Airbnb, I'm more than happy to help you with that as well. Now, with that, I'm Sebastian Muniz with EXP Realty. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification icon below. My information to contact me will be listed below, so don't hesitate to reach out, and thank you again for watching.